is incredible. Well, look who you were just talking to. I mean, the pole sitter right there. You know, very Team popular. Pop Everybody loves him. Everybody loves him. He's a and good they guy. worked very hard yeah, they're very, for that position. Yeah, I mean, he's had an incredible year. He's done really good uh, during qualifying, and I yeah. hope he has a good result tonight. I mean, in Team Ferrari, not not without some major um, uh, uphill battles, some obstacles this race. Yeah, they had a, a, certainly in first practice, it was unfortunate what happened to Ferrari and what's happening to them in the race, and taking the penalty is unfortunate, and I don't know if that's... Yeah. That's fair, but it is what it is. Yeah. So they have a lot of work to do tonight. A lot of work. He's ready, though. Oh, he's definitely ready. He's yeah. ready. Yeah, I hope he has a good race. Tell me, what do you think it is? I mean, you've been racing for 20 years, right? More well, than? Close to that. No, about, about around that he's period. He's 20, 27, 25, yeah, 27, yeah, 27. I'm trying to count the years at this point. <laughs> <laughs> you've been racing for a while. Yes, I have. I mean, it's no joke. No, it isn't. What is it about the sport that you think is starting to really catch on now? Well, I think because of Drive to Survive, we start to understand who the people are in the car. It's not just some object going around the track. Right. You start to identify with the drivers. Mm -hmm. People know who they are right. and their personalities, and they're connected to them. Right. And then the dynamics with the team owners and the struggles and the drama that goes along. Uh, who knew the drama uh, was so rich? There's always something. You know something's going to happen. You just don't know when it's going to happen. Exactly. We saw. Uh, we and you saw, hope it doesn't happen to you. You pray yeah, it exactly. ain't going to be you. Exactly. I think it was. We had um, uh, Gunther from uh, yeah. Haas, and I was like, "What is it like to go to the grocery store for you now?" He's like, "It's madness." Yeah, and he. I think he lives in South Carolina, North Carolina, something like that. And uh, yeah, he's. Uh, they all have become stars. He you said know? it's like me going to the grocery store now is like what Patrick Dempsey must be going through as Sexiest Man Alive. It's, it's, yeah, it's like, yeah, it's like yeah. wild, it's yeah. the wildest. When we go shopping together that we run into the same problem. <laughs> now, I, I, we know that you've got Ferrari coming out Christmas yes. Day. Yes. We also know there's a, this, a, another uh, uh, film, Formula One film, in the works. This uh, Brad Pitt, right. uh, Lewis Hamilton feature. What would you say, you've been doing this a long time. Mm -hmm. You know what you're doing. Right. What does Brad need to to be thinking about when he gets behind the, the, the wheel of one of these cars. I think he's having a great time behind the wheel. He looks he, like he, it. I'm sure he is. I mean, he's <laughs> making a movie because he wants to be behind the wheel. You think so? Everybody wants to be a race car driver, you know, at some point in their life. And if you can uh, get, you know, uh, your job around that and get to go train and then put it on film, that's a great thing. So I'm happy for him. Dream come true. Yeah, he's having a great time and he's driving a lot of different cars. Indeed, man. So good to see you, brother. So good to see you, too. Thank you, brother. I Thank appreciate you very that. Much. Have a good evening.